And I said to mum, hey, mum, we're Aboriginal, aren't we? And she goes, yeah, son, why's that? And then, like, it's just more the tears just started flooding. And I was like, nah, 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 nah. I don't want to be Aboriginal, mum. I don't want to be dirty. And she goes, we weren't dirty people, son. We were warriors. This is what a warrior looks like. I'm Nuki, a Yuan Tangari man, father, rapper, radio host, a little bit of everything, man. Used to get told all the time I was, I was a waste of time in my school. I'm just gonna end up behind bars with my uncles and stuff. It was over. It was either just it was football or crime. You know, I was kind of trying to figure out where do I go here. It's not football. Do I go this way? And big cousin Ryan Selway, he was um, he was someone I like. I really looked up to. I idolised him. And then he started rapping, and I thought it was the shit. Like, I was like man, what? I didn't know we could rap, cuz. And um. That's how I got into it. So yeah, he he been to this day he'd been my biggest inspiration, man. I didn't really have a big problem with alcohol until he passed away, mm. and then I couldn't deal with it, man. Like even music, music is usually where I'd go to to heal yeah. and deal with that pain. But he started me on that journey, and I going there was hard. Mm. So you know what I mean? I fell into the bottle, and. Drank myself stupid. I was kind of going downhill, like hurting myself, my family, and uh, I needed to make some changes. Getting clean and getting sober is what gave this life again. And um, it gave me the strength to pull through that in my family, you know? It was like, I wanna, you know, I wanna do something. I wanna try and make this place better for my kids. I wanna leave something behind for them, you know? The, the first time I recorded, a song, the anger and the frustration I was feeling, it was lifted, it was gone. So like music was a, became a healing for me. And then I noticed like the, the way that words had the power to affect people. And I was like, you know, this is a beautiful thing here. It's dangerous too. Like this is something, if you're gonna do this, you're responsible, you gotta do this right. And I just felt like music was my spear because that was my, that's what propelled me forward enough. We Are Warriors is a black future. Is like us represent, represented properly and being acknowledged and being on the forefront where we belong because end of the day, like, we are from here. Being a warrior is being happy with yourself and, you know, just being happy with the choices you make and it's about sharing and looking after each other. That's the way our people did. So if one wins, we all win. If one falls, then we all fall. So we roll together, you know. I get a sense of joy and pride from, you know, knowing that the, those opportunities weren't wasted on me. And I did share and I did my part to elevate our voice and our story and uh, our people. I was in the dark, the darkest place, darkest you could ever go. I learned how to turn the light on. And, and once that light's on, bros, nah, nothing gonna stop you. Look, man, I'm trying to change the world, given, you know, those kids, the ability to look inside themselves and say, yeah, I am, I am great, you know? I am a warrior and I can succeed. This is for everyone to move forward together and make this joint a better place for our kids. Black Future is not letting the past die and being on front right now, today.